Hey folks, Guardian Tiger here, and in this video, I'm gonna cover few more non-alcoholic version of an alcoholic drink. Now, in the previous video, I've covered the uh, non-alcoholic beer, which are which were actually ba uh, which were basically uh, beer flavored soda. That's it. There was no actual beer in them with you know alcohol removed. All right, which is much, I think it's much complicated and would make the drinks uh, more expensive. But uh, yeah, so that's what I covered. So I'll put that video in the description below so that you can take a look at them. But in this video, what I'm gonna cover is the flavored alcohol drinks, like they are uh, fizzy drinks with uh, different fruit flavors with alcohol. And in Japan, uh, you know, they're quite cheap but they're really, really tasty, refreshing, and uh, some of them can have really high alcohol content. So, all right, they can be as low as like a couple of uh, per percentage of alcohol, and they can be as high as 9%. So pretty, I mean, when you have them, you get uh, pretty tipsy uh, in a hurry. I certainly do. But uh, here, so for those drinks, they also, the various drinks companies that is, they uh, have also non-alcoholic version. And the reason is, if you haven't watched my previous video, uh, I'll tell you the reason again. The reason is, let's say uh, uh, you're in a party situation, all right, where uh, everybody can drink, everybody's drinking alcohol, of course, but one or two people might not be able to because of religious consideration or because they're underage or uh, for uh, pregnant women, all right? They're barred from uh, drinking alcohol, all right? It's not good for the baby. So what these uh, Japanese drinks companies have come up with are drinks that resemble the actual alcoholic versions of the drinks, all right? And uh, you can have, you can have these uh, non-alcoholic versions and can, you can blend in with the, uh, your alcohol consuming uh, uh, friends or colleagues. All right, so that's, that's the basic idea. And I think it's a very considered thing to do. I think all uh, alcohol uh, uh, drink manufacturers should come up with something that resembles the original thing so that you know, people, when you're in a party situation, you don't uh, feel left out or you don't feel the other, your other friends feel as if you're not trying to blend in. All right, I think this is a very considerate things that Japanese do, all right? Now, these three, three drinks are from Asahi, all right? So I'm gonna show it to you. And uh, yeah, this is the one uh asahi style balance all right this is a uh, grapefruit and sawa sawa tasto grapefruit and sour taste if i'm reading it properly <laughs> all right next one is uh, almost similar see that so this one is a uh, lemon sawa tasto this is lemon sour taste and last one is uh the uh apple taste uh, this one reads uh, ringo super kuringo that, that means uh, sparkling uh, apple so all of them are sparkling and they come in can form and they're totally totally uh, alcohol free now let's take a closer look at the labeling and the nutritional information and the calorie information and that will give us a very good idea of uh, how uh, how they're gonna be, all right? All right, let's take a closer look. So it reads a uh, non-alcoholic, very important. Asahi style balance. Uh, style, uh, this one reads style balance in Japanese and then, you know, uh, the name of the flavoring and it, this one reads a uh, ripe apple, yeah, sparkling drink and uh, this one what it basically reads is it uh, it suppresses dietary fat and sugar consumption I think this is uh, this is really good and it reads uh, zero sugar zero calorie and zero alcohol all right 
So let's take a look at the other one. It reads almost the same thing. All right, apart from the flavoring, of course, this is a lemon flavor. And this one is grapefruit flavor. All right, now the, the nutritional information. Now this is a 350 milliliter uh, can and there's zero calories. Now, for zero calorie drinks, uh, what we know, uh, what the reality is that, you know, these are not exactly zero calories. These can, uh, these can have uh, five, uh, up to five kilocalories uh, per, uh, uh, per uh, 100 milliliters. Uh, if, you, uh, if you can pull that off, you can uh, uh, legally call it uh, zero calories. So yeah, energy, zero calories, uh, n uh, no protein, no fat, carbohydrates at uh, 7.6 grams with, uh, with sugar. I think this one is a sugar equivalent, some kind of sweetener, no sugar. And uh, yeah. So this is dietary fiber, which is good, 5.7 grams and then salt equivalent uh, 0 0.01 to uh, 0.2. So uh, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty good. So yeah, I'll balance it here and take a look. I'll compare it with the another another one. All right, so I would say they're virtually the same apart from uh, the, all right, I'll set this aside. Apart from this one, this one is more, uh, uh, more carbohydrates and uh, sugar uh, is uh, almost the same as uh, yeah this one has a point zero one two point point four this one has up to uh, point two so this one has slightly more more uh, uh, what's it called the salt and a similar thing here all right so there's nothing much to look at i guess so you get the idea so yes uh, let's open each of them and let's give it a taste test and see how they are. All right, now let's open each of them and uh, take a and let's see how they smell and how they taste. And uh, I'll let you know which one is my favorite. All right, so let's start with the apple. Not my usually apple is not my favorite flavor, but yeah, but there was a time when I was really fond of apple. So I'm gonna open this one. See that? Yeah. First the smell. Yeah, happily. Yeah, pretty standard. Yeah. It's basically apple flavored diet drink and uh would taste really really good if it were if it were cold now for this video i did not uh, uh use the you know the refrigerated ver uh, uh, versions of these because uh, it fogs up the the packaging the can so yeah this is a yeah not bad yeah let's set this aside and let's try the the lemon and uh, citrus flavor is my favorite flavor, so I think I'm having high hopes. First, the smell. Mmm, much better. I feel happier when the flavor, uh, I mean, if it's uh, lemon, lime, citrus flavor. Okay, now let's take a, take a sip. Mm. It's a uh, tangy on the sour side and not really sweet. Only mildly sweet. Yeah. And none of these, uh, I forgot to mention, none of these have any real fruit juice. Usually Japanese like to add a little bit of fruit juice to give it more of an authentic taste so yes so that was the lemon now let's go to the grapefruit but 
Let me tell you this, uh, among the orangey thingies, uh, orangey fruits, uh, like citrus fruits, uh, grapefruit is one, one of my least favorite. But let's, uh, let's see how it is. Mmm, the smell is really good. Like uh, very grapefruity. Very, very grapefruity, very nice. So let's give it a taste test. Mmm. You know what? I like this better than the lemon one. Simply because of the sugar content. Yeah, it's this one also not very sweet. It's mildly sweet. Tangy. More, uh, more pleasant than this one. Yeah, I'd go for this one because this... The... Uh, the sour aftertaste, I don't like this one. Yeah, I'd say they're okay. I'm not over excited about them. I mean, I don't like the idea of these things as in like, would I consume them? Like, yes, I mean, let's say I'm sick and I, I cannot uh, consume alcohol. I have to uh, be in a party and, you know, blend in with people. Yes, I'll, I'm going to grab one of these and, you know, be happy. But uh, on nor normal circumstances, I would not. But let's say you want to try something different. Uh, you want to try a different soda flavor. All right. And you, you want to watch your weight. Uh, you can certainly uh, have these. Mind you, when you are in Japan. And uh, yeah, enjoy yourselves. So uh, I think that's it uh, from me now. Um, in the next video, I'm going to cover even more uh, um, similar uh, similar drinks I mean with zero calories and zero alcohol all right you know um, alcohol substitute drinks that uh, helps you blend in with your friends so I'm gonna cover a few of those and uh, yeah like and subscribe see you in the next video you have a good one thank you very much